Sup ladies, have you thought about going darker? I'll show you guys an easy way to wear this edgy look, the dark lip. Let's find the right lip color for you. But before we do that, you gotta find your undertone first. You're either cool, warm, or neutral. Alright, hold up your arms and look at your wrist. Take a closer look at your veins. Are they bluish or purple? Then you're cool. If your veins look more olive, then you're warm. And if you can't tell, you're neutral. Let's take a closer look at your favorite accessories. Are they gold? Well then most likely, you're warm. And if you tend to prefer silver, then you're probably cool. And if you can wear both, then you're neutral. Not all lipstick colors are created equal. I have here three wine lipstick colors. This one I'm holding here has a pinker undertone. It'll look great on those who have a cool undertone. It'll also help brighten your chompers. This color here has a rich warm undertone, complementing those who look great with gold accessories. And this lipstick here complements both undertones because it leans more on the neutral cool side. Awesome! Now I'm going to show you how to flaunt your dark lip. Let's do this! Take a face primer and evenly apply this all over your face to smooth it out. Now it's time to conceal any blemishes and dark circles. Usually I like to use a fluffy contour brush to apply my concealer on this way. It actually creates a beautiful airbrush finish. So start around the eyes and move out to the rest of the face to even it out. I've got a pocket full of poetry. And don't forget to powder up to keep your makeup lasting all into the night. Now let's break out your black eyeliner and tight line your eyes. Try and keep the pencil closer to the lash line because you're filling in all the empty spaces between the lashes. This will help create the illusion of a fuller lash line. If needed, curl your lashes. Take a lash lengthening mascara and sweep it through your lashes to build up the length. Finally, let's get to the meat of this tutorial, the lips. Before we color in, I need you to outline your lips with a lip pencil that matches your lipstick. Think of it like creating a wall around your lipstick to keep everything from feathering out. I mean, you don't want to end up looking like Joker at the end of the night, right? So fill it in like you're coloring in a drawing. And just blend it out. We're not quite done yet. We gotta conceal the area around the lips. Why? Because it's all about creating a clean edge when you're wearing a dark lip. This will give you that sophisticated, elegant look. Now you can use your lipstick. But instead of applying it straight from the bullet, use a lip brush. The brush will help get the product on your lips evenly. A brush gives you better precision. You're no different than a painter. You're just painting on your lips instead of a canvas. So treat this like art. That means be creative. If you want to create a sharper cupid's bow, do it. Or if you want to round them out, why not? That's the beauty of being your own makeup artist. You can become anyone with the flick of your brush. Or in this case, lipstick. And now you're done. Hmm, but something's missing. Can you guess? Yep, the brows. Notice how bottom heavy my makeup looks? You gotta balance out the rest of your face. So that means you need a stronger brow. I'll show you how much of a difference it makes. So just take your favorite brow pencil and make feathery strokes. You're creating the illusion of brow hairs. You're basically drawing on your face, illustrating your brow look. And if you wanna blend the feathery marks, flip the pencil and use the spoolie brush. And just brush it out a few times. This will blend it all out so it creates a soft, natural brow look. Alright you gorgeous people, we're finished. Are you gonna try this look out? It's intense, dark, and very vampy. You'll never know how it's gonna look until you try it out. So what's your undertone? Are you cool, warm, or neutral? Comment below to let me know. And have fun finding your shade! Good luck! Check out my makeup line at mcosmetics.com. Music by Mindy Gladehill. And don't forget to check out my website at michellefawn.com. <laughs>